hello guys welcome back to my channel this is the mbm1 channel i hope you will enjoy this video in today video we'll uh, try to build uh, or i already did uh, so we'll try to build a, a metal detector and uh, uh, this metal detector is uh, using as you can see in the pictures is with the light and you can hook your gopro on it i took some videos uh, I don't have a chance to take a long videos because my camera was uh, was a low bot so I will put in the future uh, I will put more videos and I will try to 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 find uh, a good time uh, so I did I don't have a chance I don't have a chance to to take it night but it's I will have it inshallah in the future so as you can see the the metal detector is working fine it's working great you can detect your anything you like you can detect gold or or coins or rings in the in the deep water or in the shallow water so it's 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 helpful for me okay and, uh, okay we'll move to to how we can create this this metal detector it's very easy it's not hard uh, we'll use some some tools they are available in all hardware stores it's uh, cheap it will not cost you a lot of money it's very cheap it cost me around 25 dollars like this i am th maybe 25 dollars and uh, the most expensive things it was the the metal detector it's it was uh, it was around ten dollars or something that's what the expensive thing that i bought this is the metal detector you can use any metal detector it depends of where you want to build it me i build it in a in a pc pbc pbc pipe so uh, and as you can see in the video <coughs> sorry the first thing that i did is to to make a label labeling to the to the coil from the coil as you can see there is a numbers in the coil uh, and there is a wire I extend it so uh, it would be easy for me to to modify it and and then I will take this small part for the uh, I don't know what they call it it's a uh, uh, sensitivity so I will use it I will expand it also it will be in the back of the machine uh, we will take also this LED and we will take this uh, the 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 other switch so you can switch from in this metal detector it, there is three 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 layers of there is switch on switch off and vibration and the uh, and the signal and the lights always working once you found something it's a, it's a, it's a red once there is nothing it's a green so i'm trying to remove there is only one thing here you should to to remember from where the wires is from how you take off the components you can write a schematic and then you can you can know which wire goes to where it's simple it's very easy it maybe look hard and uh, difficult but it's very easy there is uh, there is some wires and then you will connect as you can see this is the first step that i did and then we'll do the same thing for for that the blue small this uh, I don't know parameter or something and the L the LED also will expand it then we'll expand the the, vib the, the the that small motor for the vibration and then we will expand the the also the 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 power hook or as I did here as you can see in the video here I just expand nothing special I'm not modifying modifying anything just just expanding the wires so the the board will be will be down and the wires will go all the way uh, all the way to the back here is the the BBC pipe that I used so uh, you will ask me how I can get the same this you know there is some inside in the, in the hardware store there is a, a plastic it's uh, it's uh, there is all the components for the for the sink you know what they using for the sink to repair the sink that's the pack that I used it's only two dollars and it have everything inside so I uh, 
I didn't get something extra so all is it was in the back so as you can see the the the, the down I put the metal detector down and then the top I take the other uh, wires out here we will create this uh, this uh, like a for the light so we'll just do the same thing I have a small LED you can use any LED you have you can use it that's a small LED and the, uh, it's very simple I will just connect uh, two wires one to the the plus and minus then we will cut the cut one that's a switch on off so we can control our light with on and off so I will cut one of the wires you can it's better to cut the plus then we will we will connect that that uh, that uh, connector in the middle of it then we will hook the power from the from the plus and the minus it's very easy it's simple so we'll give it a try here is the my my special battery battery pack I use it for everything for all my projects so we'll give it a try here and you can see how the button is working it's fine it's working fine so and then we will connect it. this is the idea I'm just trying to give you an idea maybe and I'm sure you can create it better than me better than me you can use uh, what I want you here just to take the idea so this is the idea and you will ask me maybe how you can put the switch there and you want it waterproof it's very easy and we'll just uh, stick that button there that bottom button button sorry <laughs> that button there and then we will we will we will uh, We'll try to make uh, several layers of of uh, of uh, leak leak for the leaking leaking uh, tape. I don't know how they call that. I will show you. There's a picture of it in this video. There is a picture of it. To use it if you have some water leaking or something, you can use it. But the very most important here thing that you should to 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 sand the, the the PCB PVC pipe so you c when you will put the glue it will be more it will be more um, you know what I mean here I put already two two layers of uh, I don't know what's happened when I was recording the camera was down then I saw the the idea was just to put the the the, the lens and then put the glue and then put the first layer and the second layer and now I'm making the third layer this is the third layer just make it around 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 over the button also the switch on and off and as you can see it will be flexible you can on and off uh, very very easily see as you can see I'm putting the top of the lens and in the, around it and all the way to the to the, the half of the the light so as you can see it's simple I think I'm sorry about the video the video is very long and I don't want to make two parts you will look for the second part uh, it's okay to put uh, as long as YouTube allowing me to to put long video I will put a long video I don't want you to to go and look for a video the second one where is it and look the other one <laughs> it's okay like this I'm thinking even it's long but if you're if you're if you want to build the same you can watch it if you don't you don't like it just just leave it and look for another video <laughs> this is a great project it's a great project I'm I'm sure nobody making the same thing in YouTube there is nothing I'm trying to 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 create something new Okay, I'm not an expert. I'm just trying. I'm just thinking. Okay, and trying. Okay, it's working without any problem. Uh, and then what I will do here? Here is the the idea for this. I cut that metal detector because I try and I try to 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 use a lot of method. It's not working, so I just cut how the 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 circle of the 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 original metal detector just the the case then i cut the, the the extender wire from the board to the coil then i i sand it inside as you can see now so very well i sand it then i put the coil inside of the the first half the bottom half 
so and then I will put the silicone a kind of silicone I'm just using a normal silicone I'm not lying to you to tell you I used the waterproof silicone but it's working and if you if you found the waterproof silicone it will be more it's okay it's more I mean more it will be more professional so as you can see here I'm just trying to 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 feel to refill each uh, individual place so I don't want the water go it goes in and it will never go in because I'm sure what about what I'm doing I'm giving a time to this so and then I did the same thing for the 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 other half and then I feel it also and then I will stick them together and put the screws back then I will do the same for the for for the other part you will see in the video and here as you can see I'm putting back the the screws together then I will refill the remaining part in the top of the screws I will put some some silicone also then with the with the with the with the leaking tape or I don't know what they call that guys if you know what's the name of that put, put it in the comment please so and then I will I will rub it so to make a sure hundred person this part I cut it from the same bag that I bought that I told you about and then I I make a shave of the the the, the circle of the 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 coil so it and then I will stick it together it's easy with the same silicone and it's working fine here I'm trying to to check my batteries I'm using just a, a batteries from the old laptop I'm checking which battery because we want to build a battery so we want all all the the cells be the be, be, be to be the same the same voltage it's simple here if you don't understand what I'm doing you can just search in Google about the uh, uh, battery pack schematics and then you can you can know how to build it I have here one it's it's low voltage so I will try to push it push the to that cell up to 3.7 volt as you can see once I finish with the batteries they are all balanced so I, w I, I just connect two together minus down and the plus up so here is and then I will connect the uh, one wire goes to the minus part and the other goes to the to the plus part and then I will have two batteries uh, with the with the with the with trip with 0.7 volt and with a long life instead of one I have two, two I'm not increasing here the voltage I'm just increasing the the milliamps I mean the how I can use the batteries because what I need I need only only uh, 8 volt something like se 7 volt 8 9 volt that's what what's all what I need so here as you can see in the video just attaching the plus to the minus just be careful with what I'm doing plus to the minus and then I connect uh, this small hook it goes to the one of the cheap it was for my 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 quad capture so I hook the, the 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 I connect sorry I connect the the minus to the minus and the plus to the plus there is actually just one plus in that the one goes to the the charger it's there is only one plus the first one uh, I sorry only one minus the first one the second one is is is, uh, is a plus and the third one is a plus the second one is coming with 3.7 volt and the third one is coming with uh, with the uh, seven point it means it's go one to the other so you will connect one the first to the to the minus and the second to the plus and you will still have one in the middle it will go to the middle so that's what it's very very simple as you can see here we will try to see the part of the how I connect the the the, the, the coil to the to the board simple I'm just making the the, uh, the silicone and I cover it again with the same tape see here I'm trying to make a voice high to you know I'm swiping here a ring and some 
This is a lighter, it's working, you can hear the vibration. Then, uh, then all what I did again, I just connect, uh, connect the, the 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 other parts, and then it's done. You can paint it as you want. You can you can adjust it and as you want. This is only the idea, and I know you can do it better than me, uh, guys. And um, thank you for watching, and I hope you will encourage me with with some some comments that all what I want from you. Uh, thank you for watching. And I hope you will like this project and see you in the next pro uh, the next project. Thank you.